Mr. Roger, Mud Falls University, and this is just a very quick introduction to what I am going to propose in the next video, which is electron flood theory, and there are no neutrons. Electron flood means that all these little tiny white particles that you see in our experiments there are free electrons. They flood everywhere. And when they get excited, they glow with these little tiny white particles. They glow. Now, the electrons also are, I believe, light. And they are particles. They can accelerate. This is the proof of that. They create the Higgs bosons, the bosons and then the Higgs fields, which are polarized fields when this accelerated light crashes. We've created a new unknown particle. These are the actual, well that is the actual particle of light as it slows down. It is a dipole as you can see. And I believe they're all particles are dipoles. There are no such thing as neutrons. And this displays the right hand rule. This introduction to electron flood theory, and I'm going to show you absolute proof of the things that I'm saying. Well, I say it's absolute proof. I'd like to have it challenged because right now it's being avoided because it, it, it's a new atomic model where there is no neutrons. The neutrons are literally bar magnets. If you smash an atom, in an atomic bomb and you break it into pieces it is no longer stable resonance stable the little bits and pieces in the nuclear core are not neutrons when they fly out of there they're little bits and pieces like bar magnets I'm going to show it very clearly so if you're interested in this number two will be electron flood theory no neutrons all right if you're not that's fine all right but I'd appreciate honest scientific look at, at the work and not somebody just that doesn't like science and, and thumbs it down because I see a lot of that. So I'm looking for some real evidence on this, somebody to challenge this work, not just to dismiss it. All right, thank you.